Okay, what swing check does is it guides the golfer's club to the correct top of the back swing position, going through all the correct on plane position on route. Configuring swing check is easy. First of all, you've got height settings on the base here to set the plane angle. This is adaptable, moves up and down, so you can set the correct shaft plane here. Now, what we want to do is configure swing check so that where the rods cross is the same height as the club that you're using. We consider this to be a critical point in the swing to check. From here, place the club on the diagonal rod, assuming you have correct dress position, swing up to the first position here. Now you can see that the club shaft is now exactly the same point where the rods cross, so I know the butt end is being kept up. The shaft is also parallel to the baseline rod here. My right forearm is also on plane. I'm checking that against this rod here. I can see that it's in the same angle. My shoulders are also on the same plane angle as, a, as this diagonal rod here. So I now can see that my shoulders are working on the correct plane angle. Neither too flat nor too steep. So once I've actually got this position right, I then continue up to the next checkpoint where the rods cross with plane shifting off of the shaft plane onto the baseline plane. The checkpoint here is that the, rod, the club shaft is now parallel to the diagonal rod and I can now continue on up to the next position where the shaft is now parallel to the baseline rod and on plane. Then I make several swings up to the top of the swing, trying to get the feel of that, then step forward, get yourself into position and hit the ball.